All right, adventurers, welcome to All Play. Uh, today we're playing a game called Steam World Dig. You might say, "Hey, chill! Didn't we play this already?" No, we played Steam World Dig Two, and that game was a lot of fun. Uh, I was given a code in order to play that game on the channel, and I posted the video. And then, very, I, I guess, like two days later, I was contacted by the the same company, and they said, "Hey, we would love for you to play Steam World Dig." Number one, I was like, that's kind of backwards, but let's go ahead and do it. So they gave me this code as well. How to play SteamWorld Dig on the channel. Now, in the description below, you'll see a link to where you can find this. I believe it's available on Steam, and it's also available on many different uh, Nintendo platforms. I have a link that will tell you exactly where you can find it, as well as how you can keep up with the developers yourself. Now, within any further ado we're gonna get into this and we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna give this roughly an hour of play time now what's cool is steam world dig 2 i played that before uh, i played on the channel i played it on my 3ds and then i played it on the switch this is the switch version and i haven't touched this one at all now for i'm gonna guess that steam world dig 2 didn't give me any spoilers about this game other than there's a character named Rusty. I'm guessing that's Rusty right there. Let's hop in. Let's stop talking and let's hop in. I've been talking for way too long. Let's look at some options. Let's look at some options. Hmm. Those are some options, all right. Okay. Uh, I believe it's going to teach me the controls inside, so I'm not going to waste my time and look at this uh, now. Let's go ahead. Oh, slot A, of course. So Rusty got dropped in. Mm. Well, I don't reckon I'll get out the way I got in. Could be part of my uncle's mind, I guess. All it needs is a splash of paint. Better explore it before the rest of my light dwindles. All right, so it already... Oh, oh, look who it is. Say, what do you think you're doing? Your dramatic interest just caved the roof in. I'm sorry, miss. My uncle sent me to claim the claim to this mine. I was heading to Tumbledon to find out why when I fell through. Oh, you're Joe's nephew? He's been gone a while. I've been sneaking down here mining what little I can and I just found him. I'm sorry. You should go see for yourself. All right. Interesting. Um... What was I going to say? I was going to say that I've played through SteamWorld Dig 2 all the way, and it's a really... What, oh, this is to talk to her. It is a really great game. I really enjoyed it all the way. Well, I'm missing, like, one part, the very, the very, very final part for me to 100% the game. It's been a while, Uncle. Sorry I didn't make it here before you left us. You always claim we were so much alike. Can't say I understand why you sent me the claim, though. I'm no miner. Well, I hate to rob you of your plunder. If I could just borrow your pickaxe, I might get out of this calaboose. I'm using that word from now on. I'm using calaboose from now on. All right, so obviously we're, we're continuing, or we're, we're starting the mechanics from uh, SteamWorld Dig 2 with a pickaxe. We can dig. This is all too familiar. I like the voice I gave Rusty. <laughs> See, you found a pickaxe. You do look a proper miner with it. That's good. The lever opening that door out of here got buried when you dropped in. You have to clear out a tunnel below us to get to it. All right, so I got to find the lever. Uh, we can see on our map in the right corner, we can see where we need to get in order to open this to open this here level it looks very much like the mechanics are the same i wouldn't expect any less from the first game in the series after playing the second it just looks i want to say graphically it looks worse but it does it does it's very obvious how they improved between the second game i'm sorry between the first game and the second it's very obvious to me but this doesn't look bad at all 
It doesn't look bad at all. The other ones, the first one's just a little bit more fleshed out, you know? See, I've got health. It seems like I took damage. It's probably from the fall because I haven't really reached anything. That could di that could damage me just yet, miss. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like Rusty's voice. I actually gave him a good voice. I'm comfortable doing that voice. All right. The door should be open. Mm -hmm. Now I'm not going to get out of here. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. One of the mechanics is we can wall jump. <laughs> We could do is a little bit of wall jumping. Now that's one thing that's different. When I hit my head, you hear it. I don't remember that being in the the uh, the second game. Oh, and to keep track of how deep I've gone too. I can't dig on that. All right, okay, that's cool. That's actually something that wasn't in the first game. That makes me think that this is going to be important. You know, I feel like it wouldn't keep track of a stat like that if it wasn't important. Now, these guys, these don't look like the same enemies from before. The other ones had like a red glow about them. It looked like they had, they, they would have been this, that enemy, but with a shell or something, you know? All right, looks like I can get out up this way. Oh, we're here at Tumbleton. Oh, look at the late little girl. <laughs> Let's talk to her. Nice to see a new face in town, especially such a handsome one. Don't get many newcomers. Folk are more likely to move in the other direction. So, you're our new miner. Sorry to see old Joe finally go. He not looked, he not looked well for some time now. You're a quiet fellow just like him, huh? You just let me do the talking there. You got it, ma'am. No, I wasn't trying to talk. I was trying to look up. No, no. You got it, ma'am. There we go. <laughs> you handle that mine like a real pro. Seeing as you're the new owner and all, maybe you should keep it open. Bring any ore you find back up to me, and I'll give you a fair rate for it. Interesting. This town sure can use it. I'm Dorothy, by the way. Now, why don't you try mining some precious stones? All right, so my aim, I was going to say, let's do this for about an hour. But since this is more or less the very same mechanics as the previous game, in fact, maybe even a little bit less fleshed out because, of course, this is the first in the series. Uh, let's go for 30 minutes. Let's go for 30 minutes unless, unless we find something that's super, super interesting that wasn't in the second game. I mean, I enjoyed the second game. I enjoyed playing through the second game. It was a lot of fun. Uh, there, there's probably nothing in that game. You want to be real about it? There's nothing in that game that would probably change. That said, let's see what I want to see what what there is that's different in the first game. What did they take out in the second game that was in the first game? That's that's kind of what I want to do here. Let's let's take a look at that. Yellow. There we go. Oh, I don't get the I don't get a thing from him. I heal. I healed. Okay, let's go up here. Let's go around. Now, one of the things I think I said, I'm pretty sure I said it in the video, is that um, you want to be careful about how you dig. You want to be able to dig in many different places. So, for like example, I can't dig on the tile that's immediately to my right from here unless I'm standing right on the edge of this one, and then I can dig there. Uh, I realized as I played through the game, eventually that changes. Eventually that changes. Uh, through the use of getting new power-ups and getting upgrades through cogs and things like that uh, It actually becomes possible to dig throughout, throughout through the course of the game It becomes very possible to dig anywhere to, to kill any tile So like right now, there's no way for me to open up the tile that's immediately above Rusty when I jump But through the course of the game, I'll probably get power-ups and upgrades that'll make it so that I can dig through this in more than one way that's not, I hope that's not spoiling it too much. Like, it should be obvious that the game was going that way. And it should have been obvious to me in the first hour that I played that the game would have gone that way. All right, so we're getting trashy on, which is worth $1. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and say that I'm, I'm, I'm jumping the gun here. I know I am. I'm about to go ahead and say it. I'm going to assume that as you go deeper, 
you'll find more valuable gems and ores and things like that. Looks like you're getting the hang of it. You should go see my daddy at the upgrade shop. He'll fix that pickaxe so you can dig even deeper. No need to tell him you saw me down there earlier, though. All right. Upgrade unlock, sharp pickaxe. Dope. Now, one of the things that happened in the second game is that as you leveled up, as you leveled up, you would get a bonus, a percentage bonus for all the, the gems that you turned in. It seems to me that there is no bonus here, which is interesting, which is interesting. Now I've got something to work with. What do you have then? I'll sharpen that pickaxe for you. Let you dig into hot as soil. Uh, it's going to cost us eight cash. Luckily, we got 10 cash. Dope. That's enough of that now. That's enough of that now. That's enough of that now. I get I get what he's trying to get me to do. He wants me to. Oh, he's just going to keep talking. He wants me to leave. Got it. That pickaxe should let you dig on the harder, harder dirt deeper down. When I was scavenging for ore, I found something else too. A cave. You might want to check it out. Joe used to bring all sorts of stuff down there. Be careful though. Critters have been a bit feisty since the last time he went missing. Since around the time he went missing. Okay. Dope. That's also something that I found really interesting. And I kind of want to see. Oh, it let me go through that in one in one shot. And this guy won't tackle me. Okay. He just walks side to side. Ready to die. Ready to die for his ready to die for his cause. Ooh, got me. <laughs> okay, so previously I couldn't dig through this dirt. The dirt to my left and the dirt below me. I could dig that dirt up there with no problem. This one now takes three three shots. Dope, I'm with it. Now I wonder oh, I was gonna say, how am I supposed to keep track of my light? It's in the top right corner. The top right corner is what I can use to keep track of how much light I have available. It, it wasn't apparent to me because last time I was in the top left corner. That, my health, and in another another uh, another attribute that I had to take care of or I had to monitor was in the top left. So now it's all over the place. Wonderful. That stone's not going to fall. Okay. That's not the same stone as... Uh, let's see. How want to do this? Let's do it this way. Wait, oh shoot. Wait, hang on, hang on. Let's do this the smart way. I wanna get I wanna get those jobs. Right now I have to worry about doing things the, the best way possible. Oh shoot, I monked up. I monked up. Okay, here's what I can do. Here's what we can do. How about we oh shoot, it's gonna break it though. It's gonna break it though. Oh shoot. Okay. Uh Damn. Oh, okay. Oh, shoot. It's not going to let me. Damn. Okay. I, I, I got this. I got this. I got this. It's okay. It's okay. I've been here before. I can do this. Come on. Come on. Let's see if I can find that cave. I guess that's what's on the map right there. I want to get to that cave. I, that's that's another, uh, another feature that I want to really take a look at and see how that difference. Now we got Cytrine, which is worth much more than Trashium. Much more than Trashium. That's good. That's pretty dope. No room. Okay. So if you look at the bottom of the screen, you'll see that I have three different kinds of gems. And then I have so many that I can carry for each one. I'm maxed out, so I can't carry anything else. I hope that's there when we get back, because I think that might have been the Cytrine. Hopefully that's there when I come back. We will see. This town sure can use some growth. Dude. Back down we go. I should have upgraded something else, but I'll be okay. I'll be okay for now. After I after I find this thing. We'll see. Did it disappear? Oh no, it's still there. Okay, good. Good. Oh, it's trashium. Trashium. Hashtag trashium. Wake up, y'all boys. Wake up, y'all boys. Whoop! He woke up on me. Wake up, y'all boys! All right, let's see. Now there was something I was trying to do. I got sidetracked. <laughs>
I get sidetracked a little bit too easily, you know? Let's dig. Let's dig. My health is, is blinking at me. My health is blinking at me. That can't be good. Okay, so here's what I want to do. One, two, three, four. Shoot. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I'll be okay. Trashium. All that for trashium. I'm upset. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. This is how we're gonna do it. Bam! It didn't do anything, but that's okay. Ain't do anything important, but that's okay. Okay, so the cave is right there. Ooh, old boy's gonna wake up. Damn! He woke all the way up. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do, this is how we're gonna do it. I wanna explore, I wanna get into this cave and check it out. And see how the caves were before. Before Steam World Dig 2. Back, back up. Copper. Copper? Alright. So this I'm this I, does this mean this is the first cave? Give me that. If I mess up. Ah! Oh! <laughs> That's exactly what I was trying to prevent. Okay. So you see I have the white spaces uh below at the bottom of the screen. Uh, so I should be able to pick this up, but because this is a different kind of gem, uh, I don't have space for it. I can only put like gems in the same areas. So let me once again head back up. <laughs> let me head back up. At first, I thought this was tedious. I thought this was tedious, but this is actually a really cool, I don't want to say a way to limit you because it's not really limiting you. It's forcing you to figure things out, though. It's forcing you to figure out how to make things work. All right, so we got a couple more upgrades available. Dope. All right, let's uh, let's buy some things before we go back down. So you're keeping your uncle's mind open. Dangerous place. Lost my leg to a shiner while fixing an old tube in their mine tunnels. Guess I commended myself, but the cobbler's barons aren't a, are a the worst shod, as we say in the old country. Still, we're a mining town. Can't really get along without a mine now. What do you have then? Uh, so I can increase my health for free. Give you a nice. Oh no, it will restore my health. Okay, <laughs> for free. Uh, let's see. I got. I have forty gold, so I can only do one thing. The ladder. Petrol thing. Keep on your purse. You can stack them on top. Oh, so this is something that absolutely was not in the other game. There was no sense of a ladder on me. And this is for my lamp. I can increase my lamp. Uh, let's do this. How about we do medium pouch so I can carry more things at one time. And then we do ladder. Let's explore with that. I want to I wanna see, I wanna see uh, what all that does because that's something completely different. There was no sense of a ladder. How would I? How? 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 Uh, what's the ladder But oh, oh. Can I get my ladder back? Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> I, okay. Now, hang on, let, hang on, let me explore a little bit. How do I get my ladder back? Do I get my ladder back? Oh, snap, I gotta rebuy them. Okay, I think I see why that wasn't brought back. <laughs> I think I see why it wasn't brought back. Okay, it's fine. I guess I guess what we go after. Oh well, useless. Oh, I guess I can stand on it, and now I can get this one. Now it's useless. <laughs> now it's useless. I set out to make that one a waste of. I understand 100 why they did not bring that one back. Good job, good job, game developers. You figured one thing out. You did your research here, boy. Come on. Come on. Boom. Ah! It still stuck me. Okay, now let's go into that mine. I've I played around enough. Let's go into that mine. Or that cave rather. And see what's up. Let's see what's up. Give me that citrine. Alright. So if you didn't check out the first video uh where I played Steam World Dig 2, the 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 Caves are effectively puzzles. They're puzzles where you need to figure things out. Like there's, I don't want to say an easy path, but there's a way to, to solve the puzzle or solve the cave. And then there's a way to 100% the cave to get everything in there. 
I wonder if the game will actually tell me. Will tell me whether I've 100%ed it or not. Let's see, can I go up here? Yeah. See, I'm already. I'm already. I'm already ready for a 100% run. Like I said, I I didn't 100% uh, Steam World Dig 2. I I literally am missing one thing to have 100% of the game. It's wild, and I don't think I'm ever gonna do it. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, so I can't dig through this now, and that's okay. Just means I have to come back later. Just means I have to come back later. That was the trick to many of the puzzles or many of the caves. I had to come back later to be able to 100% them. Technology assimilated. Speed boots. Okay. So one of the things... Oh, go back to town. One of the things I've been trying to do this entire playthrough, just because of me playing the, fr uh, the second game all the way through, is run. If I want to run here, I can hold the Y button. Take off. That's the only way I can get through this part, actually. Uh-oh. Is there a thing here? Oh, no, I guess not, so I can't trap myself. What's down here? What's down here? There's something down here. I ain't dumb. Last thing I am is dumb. Oh, wait. <laughs> Never mind. Belay that. <laughs> there we go. All right, so there's a lot of things hidden here that I absolutely cannot get because I don't have a strong enough, um, I don't have a strong enough pickaxe. All right, so the run jump, that's the only way I can get to certain heights. So for example, my jump normally can't get me that high, but if I use the run jump, perfect. Uh, let's see, nah, let that go, okay. So what I'm gonna do is go for this way. Since the game thinks I'm dumb, nothing hidden here. Oh, let's see. Oh, can I do this? I don't think I can do it in this one. I can barely do it in the second one. Let's see. Ah! <laughs> nah, I don't think I can go up from there, though. Ah! I can make that one. What's this? Woo! Some orbs? Orbs? What are orbs for? Orbs! I, I, I only know they're orbs because I saw something about orbs for an upgrade. Whatever. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Getting out of here. All right. Dope. Uh, let's see if we can find some more things worth money. Let's try and get rich. The damn train. How about? Whoop. You almost got me. Whoop. Him in the spring. All right, boys. All right, boys. Need you to chill out. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Up. Uh, Up. Uh. Yeah, all the trash, all the trash. All right, let's see. We got to go back to town now. The arrow on our map is telling us, hey, idiot. Hell are you doing? Go back to town. My ladder here. This ladder. <laughs> I'm genuine. I'm actually mad about the ladder. Not going to lie. <laughs> Dang, what's that on your feet? I have never seen anything quite like that. Did you find that in the cave? You think Joe left it there for you? Maybe there's more down in the mine somewhere. Did you show it to my father? You really should. Dude. Look at my, hey bro, look at my J's. What are those? So, you found, so, oh sorry, wrong voice. So, you found one of Joe's caves, did you? Don't know what unnatural stuff he was up to down there. Cogs and steam that I get. He meddled with some weird things he did. Sometimes I let him stack some of it here in me store. Weird glowing stuff. I'd rather seen him store it in the cave he dug deeper down. What do you have then? All right, so we can upgrade our pickaxe once again. Let's do that. Let's see what else is there. Our lamp can be upgraded. Now, the lamp is supposed to kind of limit you to how much you can explore. Uh, but if you're not scared, at least in the same game, if you're not scared of traveling in the dark, you can go ahead and do that. So I wonder what I wonder what I need the lamp expanded for. You can mark out a spot you want to keep bright with these placeable lamps. Oh, placeable lamps. Oh, that answers my question then. <laughs> 
Uh, let's see. I, get, I mean, I can't really upgrade anything else, huh? Let's not use that just yet. Let's let's make our way without it. All right, so we can now go deeper once again since we've upgraded our pickaxe. All right. I kind of like that it's keeping track of how deep we are. That's one thing. That's one thing that I wanted to know in the game before. In the, in the uh, let's see, since I already have the the ladder, let's use it. Uh, that's one kind of one of the things I wanted to know for sure. Oh Jesus! Whatever. We're going the other way. We're going the other way. That's one of the things I kind of wanted the game to tell me. How deep was I? You can kind of. Oh no! Shoot! Shoot! Did I mess that up? I messed it up. Well, never mind. Uh, that's one of the things that you can kind of see in the other game, but it's not really telling you how deep you are. Now you can get a vast look at the map and say, oh man, I, I'm I'm several caves deep, but there's no sense of number. Like right now, I know that I'm 40 meters deep because I can just look at the map and it says 40 meters. And that's actually really cool. I like that. I like that. Uh, maybe I should have put the ladder here. Is this another cave? Yes, it is. Yeah, yes, it is. I it do. Oh, we're out of light. We're out of lamp. What did he say I'm out for? Oh, my lamp is steadily moving down. You look in the top right, it's going down just because I'm standing here. Before, it only did that when we moved. Interesting. And it's still even doing it here in this cave. Ah, oh, we got water. We got water. We're getting to one of my favorite things from the, the second one. So I'm, I'm glad that's here. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Shoot, I think I might. I think that might be the case. Let's see. Water. Is I not supposed to come here? Not yet, at least. Cause I need water. Ah, oh, got it, got it. Won't get me. Tell me I can't do something. We got more orbs. Let's see. Our map is saying we shouldn't be here. Our map is saying go back here. Okay, so we need to go deeper still. And even on our map, it's telling us what level pickaxe we need to progress. Which, to be honest, I don't think that's a bad thing. I mean, it's obvious at one point we're going to need a certain level. At one point, we're going to need to get to the next level. It's just it's just letting us skip figuring it out or wasting our time. It's letting us skip wasting our time. Got him. Sucker. I noticed these enemies don't drop gems. They only drop stuff to help me recover recover health or recover lamp or recover water. Nothing when it comes to Nothing when it comes to getting rich. I know before they dropped blood gems, which meant that I could uh I could kind of farm the enemies, you know? I can just go on a hunt and kill them all. Oh sh every time. That's another thing I'm realizing. There's no other. Let me see. Can I look at the map? No. Um. I guess I can't look at the map. Not up close. There's another thing I noticed. There's no easy way for me to get back uh, above ground. Like I have to, at least as far as far as I've uncovered, I have to travel the entire way back through what I've dug up. I can't. Uh. Please be copper. Nope. Okay. I can't use a, a teleporter to get back up. Now, I wonder if that's something I'm going to unlock or if that just isn't here. Either way, I'm interested to play through it and find out. I hope it's the teleporter, but if I have to keep traveling back up to, honestly, it's not too bad, question mark. <coughs> Best exchange rate in town. Well, the only one. All right. Let's see if we can upgrade some else. You break it, you bought it. Uh, looks like we can't upgrade our pickaxe yet. We need four more. We get a coal lantern. Uh, plus 60 second light duration. If we upgrade your furnace to burn coal instead of wood, it'll shine a wee bit longer. Okay. So those are the actual lamp upgrades. Now I wonder if I I just can't explore anymore without any light. 
I wonder if I just can't all together. Let's see. Talk to her. Those are some mighty fine boots you've gotten. Bet you're as quick as a greased in steam hog with them on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Let's go deeper. I want to I wanna see what the red air was pointing to at least. I know I said I'd go for 30 minutes, but I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying this. It's fun. It's, a, it's, a, it's like a whole new adventure, to be honest. Wait, one, two. Let's do one. Can I do... I wanted to go all the way down. I wanted to go as far down as possible. So let's do that. Wait, wait. Let's do that. Yeah! Causing mayhem! Curtis! <laughs> all right. Let's, oh, wait, 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 wait. Didn't I leave some treasure? Oh, shoot. I'm wasting my light. I'm wasting my light. Let's go over here. Let's take a shortcut. Let's build, let's build us. Well, it's not even a shortcut anymore. Let's build us a shortcut back. How about that? Cause we we we's gonna take the long road. Let's build us a short road back. Let's build us a short road back. And we go down. Wait, actually, let's go this way and then here. Ooh, sucker. Let's grab this. Uh, I guess we'll do the same thing again right here. And I can, ooh, I can go this way. Down here. And we can go on down this way. Dope. Moving. All right. Can't dig through that. You can't dig through that, chill. What's wrong with you? Wait, can I get that? Uh, we are we are blowing our light. We are blowing our light. It looks like I'm gonna assume since the next light upgrade is for 60 seconds, I'm gonna assume each one of those bars. I really don't have room. I really don't have room. Can I can I throw away one of these? Shoot. Uh. Okay. So let's throw away the copper. One thing I can do is throw away. Oh, it's not even gonna ask me. I can throw away gems. If it means that I can get some other things that'd be much more valuable. I guess what I need to do is upgrade how much, how many different stacks I can have because Lord have mercy. This ain't nothing. <laughs> this ain't nothing. Let's see. I got a little bit of time left on this lamp situation. It looks like I might not be able to get in there at all. Yeah, I can't get in there. Okay, let's get out of here. I don't want to know what happens if I run out of lamp. It's, it's not looking bright. It's not looking bright for us here. No pun intended. Come on. Come on, let's get back to the surface. Come on. Dig for me. Dig and jump for me. Here we go. Uh-oh. Need light. Okay, so it's not going to kill me. I just can't see anything that I haven't uncovered at all, which is which is... Good, that is not gonna kill me. Cause the Lord have mercy. I would hate to die down in these mines. You'll find more valuable ore the deeper you get. Oh yeah? Appreciate it. All right, let's upgrade stuff. Let's go for the big pouch. I know I said I was gonna do the coal lantern. Let's do the big pouch, just so we can carry more stuff. The, bit, the, the more stuff we can carry at once, the faster we can upgrade everything. This is actually really beneficial to, to get that pouch, to get that pouch big. Mm. I like it. One thing I tell you, boys, I do and show and love me. <laughs> I do and show and love me a big old pouch. Mm. Here we go. Let's dig deep. <laughs> Let's dig deep. Uh, I can't get up there. Uh, let's see. I, I, I genuinely cannot dig in there huh how about this let's let's so i don't mess this up can i yeah i can get through there now but i can't get that up there i monk that up i'm good at messing things up i don't know if you guys have realized this yet or not i'm when it comes to messing things up a1 I'm, I'm, it's on my resume chill professor m messer up of things 
see. I want to get to that red arrow. Hopefully, that leads to a new cave. I, I want to explore another cave. And, and maybe, just maybe, that'll give me a power up so I can go back to the previous cave and do my business there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Look at these boys. Y'all see these boys? They're going to wake up on me. Won't be up. Mm hmm. Woo! I, I don't know why I didn't expect that, to be honest. Don't know why what I was thinking. I need to pay a little bit more attention. Bam, 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 bam. Mm. Somebody call the exterminator? No oh, way. I am the exterminator. Bam. All right. Let's see. I'm getting a little bit off. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit off in more ways than one, but I need to, I need to head back the other way. Let me run out of light soon. Come on. There we go. Come on. Got him. Yeah. Looks like we reaching the, the area we need to reach. Mm -hmm. Woo! Joke's on me. Hey, is this a teleporter? This is just what I was complaining about, isn't it? Sure, it sure is. Mm -hmm. Let's sell some things. What have you got for me? All right. Back down we got. Oh, wait. Let's take the teleporter. All right. They're going to wake up on me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, shoot. How would I get that? And not die. <laughs> I really almost risked my life for four dollars. For four whole dollars, I really risked my life. Okay, chill. You need to get your priorities in order. I don't know what happened. I don't know how you got here, <laughs> but you need to get your priorities in order. Mm -hmm. Let's go in here. All right, let's see what trouble befalls us. What trouble befalls us? It's a cog. Is that an upgrade? Whatever, man. We out of here. Bam! No! Oh! I was actually trying to go to left or right. I don't know if I could, but I was trying to see what was possible. Yeah! Oh, that's a big boy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He ain't friendly. He ain't friendly. All right. Okay, boy. Okay. That's obviously not the way to go about it anymore. The steam jump. How do I steam jump? Hey, game. I need you. I'm asking you, game, how I steam jump. That means I need you to get me some directive on how. Can I not kill him? Oh. Never mind. I need some directive on how I steam jump. Is that what the water's for? I guess that's what the water's for. Now it's in the top left corner. I'm pressing all the buttons. Nothing's happening. That's happening. This game lied to me. It said I can steam jump. Oh, down and B. That makes sense, right? That makes sense. Oh, can I steam jump through this? Sure the hell can. I sure the hell can. Oh, I need water, though. I need water. Okay. Okay. Let's get out of this cave. Uh, one thing I want to do before I call it. Let's get out of this cave and then go back. Um... And then go back to the previous cave, the one that I skipped over. Or not skipped over. Didn't didn't do everything that I could, obviously. Oh, it's gonna be one of these puzzles, huh? Okay. I'm with it. Let's try every possible combination. There we go. <laughs> uh let's go back to the previous cave to see what all I can find. 
see see what all I can now do with this thing jump. Bam! Oh wait, I wasn't strong enough. I played myself. Now this water doesn't look like water. This water looks poisonous. This water looks like y'all trying to murder me. Oh wait, up here. I ain't silly. I seize it. Hey, that's worth 25. That's pretty dope. Oh no, I actually use up water? Wait a minute. I don't like this mechanic. I don't like this one at all. I actually use up water. It's not a it's not a, an infinite resource. Oh no. <laughs> that wasn't in the previous game at all. Oh, that's ugly. Oh. <laughs> that's ugly. <laughs> okay, so we got to be we got to be picky about how we use our water in the desk. Now I'm sure that's going to be a puzzle mechanic. You can't tell me that's not going to be a puzzle mechanic. Okay, now let's head back up. Oh, that's wasteful. That's wasteful, chill. Let's head back up. And not all the way to the surface, but let's head back to the previous cave. And I want to see what all I can do in there with the steam jump. If anything, I don't know if I can do anything at all, really. The steam jump's cool. Oh, I can I, I can get that, right? Nope. Oh, Lord, I've, I've wasted my resources. The steep jump's cool because it lets me do a few things that I couldn't do before, as always. Uh, but I guess I have to be super careful since we out here draining water. We out here draining resources. I guess I better be careful, huh? Oh, I couldn't get up here at all, could I? Wait, I think I could. I think I, could. I, had, to, I had to play around with it. Ah, I think I had it too. I had it. I was just slow on the reflexes. I'm good for being slow on the reflexes. Let's see. Damn. Chill. If you if you if you're running to get a head start, you come to a complete stop. You you are completely undoing the hard work that you put in. Damn. I suck at this. I suck at this part of the job. Okay. So I couldn't get up. Oh, I could. Was there, is there nothing else in here for me? There's nothing else in here. Why do I want to come back here so bad? <laughs> Let's go back to the surface. I'll call it there. We'll head back to the surface and we'll call it. We'll see what all else we can actually in here. There was something else. Wasn't it? No, nope. We're, we're going to stick. We're going to stick to our guns still. You said you're going back to the surface. Let's have that be it. Oh, come on, Rusty. Mm. Got this. One. All right. There's our ladder that we wasted. That means we're near. Okay. That's a nice milestone marker. Say, you found more of that strange technology. Weird how it just fits you like that. Like it's made for you. Mm hmm. Dope. All right, guys. That's going to do it. This was us taking a look at Steam World Dig. Once again, all the information for you to check out this game for yourself, as well as keep up with the developers, is in the description below. Feel free to check that out and tell them, tell them, and tell them Chill sent you. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video and love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. I said subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way you can notify whenever I go live with the stream or whenever I post a video like this. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play.